<laughs> she thinks I have an unboxing for her. Horn blasters. Check out what I just got. Check it out. That's what I got. <laughs> yeah, I got a train horn. And now I have a PA system I'm going to be installing in the 370Z. Yeah. Oh man. This is going to be so much fun. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. The things I do, I have to take this whole rear bumper off to be able to mount this train, uh, what is it, PA, PA system. So, my dirty, I'm going to clean all this while I'm back here. But I just want to kind of give you an idea. Yeah. Fun times. <laughs> uh, fun times, fun times. Such a pain, but the rear bumper, all the wiring, which I gotta adjust a bunch of stuff. So that's gonna be fun. But I, I basically I'm gonna mount it to the crash bar right here. Right here in this space. That way it's nice and flush. Plenty of room. There's plenty of room behind the bumper, it's just dead space. So I'm gonna face it this way so the audio goes down and out. You can see my LEDs. But what I want to show you is right there. Now I gotta mind you, hopefully the bumper fits back on. It, I did the spacing, it looks like it should be fine. But um, I basically tap and use the tap and die set to drill hole uh, well, use the drill, drill bit, size it out, then I had a tap and die set to thread it so that way I can just bolt it straight in it ain't going nowhere bolted this back in now I'm gonna run the wires I think right through right here into the trunk that way I can wire it later that way it's inside the trunk and uh, nice and cleanly done and go from there yeah fun times and there is space by the way if you look it, it there's there is space for the audio to carry but this is just kind of the best thing I can do. This back on, it is, you can't see it. Fits perfectly fine. It's tucked up down in there. Just barely, it's got a couple inches in there. Can't really see it, but it's right there. So, and then the wires come in right here. Now all I have to do is figure out Mounting that under the glove box. I still have to put the tablet part back in, but underneath the glove box. And then wiring, wiring the tail light, tail light wires to that fuse block. The horn, horn wires to the uh, fuse block and then to that so that's yeah, gonna be fun fun times so I know it's hard to see but the wires all come through here power goes to there the two speaker wires go to the speaker um, the ground is actually grounded which I can't really show you because I already closed everything up but in here is where I actually grounded it as well as hooked up the accessories for my LEDs but I now have a CB and with the CB I have accessory switch so I can turn on all my LED lighting from this one switch right here inside the car. There's two of them. So then I have the CB. What's cool is you see it. All the controls and everything like that. So all the controls. I can just reach in there, but cop pulls you over. You don't see it at all. <laughs> so, yep, that's it.